let us move on to the next question it is again related to matrices how many 3 cross 3 that is third order square matrices m with entries 0 1 2 are there for which the sum of the diagonal entries of m transpose into m is 5 these are the given options now let us assume m a third order matrix a1 b1 c1 again a2 b2 c2 and a3 b3 c3 now what is the product of m transpose into m now here we have m transpose that is a1 b1 c1 and a2 b2 c2 a3 b3 c3 now when we multiply this with m which we have assumed here you can clearly notice a very important thing the diagonal entries that means we have to look only for the diagonal entries so the first diagonal entry you can notice here is a1 square a2 square and a3 square similarly we can go for this and this when you calculate all the diagonal entries it is simply sum of square of all the numbers or all the entries so that means the sum of diagonal entries is sigma a i square b i square c i square where i varies from 1 to 3 that means these are total 9 in numbers and the sum is given that is equal to 5 now possible values kaun kaun si hai hamare paas 0 1 and 2 that means koi bhi value yahan pe 0 1 2 ho sakti hai ab hum uska square karenge to hamare paas values kya aayengi hamare paas value aayegi 0 1 and 4 ab hame sum 5 chahiye aur yahan pe total jo hamare paas addition hona hai wo 9 digits ka hona hai jiski value 0 1 agar hum square karte hain aur 4 possible hai to hamare paas possibility kya ho rahi hai ek possibility hogi ki koi bhi ek number ki value 2 ho jaye to uska square 4 hoga aur ek number 1 ho jaye aur baki sare 0 hone padenge because sum ko hame lana hai 5 to that means out of these 9 1 has to be 2 other has to be 1 and all rest 7 has to be 0 ye possibility permutate hogi in 9 digits ke beech mein so definitely the number of ways upon factorial 7 please understand because there are 7 zeros so they are similar so this is the total number of cases when 1 is 2 other is 1 and all rest are 0 there is one more possibility a core possibility yahan pe hai ki 5 one value lenge or charge lenge or zero lenge tab bhi aap sum so sakte hai, five hoga so this is the another permutation for the next case now summing these two values will give you answer 198 so the answer of this question is d so d is the right answer for us चलते हैं अगले प्रॉब्लम पे प्रॉब्लम नंबर 41 इसमें क्या दिया हुआ है थ्री रैंडमली चूज इन नॉन नेगेटिव इंटीजर्स x y z आर फाउंड टू सेटिस्फाई द इक्वेशन x plus y plus z is equal to 10 देन द प्रोबेबिलिटी दैट z इज इवन यहां पे इंपॉर्टेंट वर्ड जो नोट करने वाला है वो है नॉन नेगेटिव दैट मींस किसी की भी वैल्यू जीरो या पॉजिटिव होगी नेगेटिव नहीं होगी वैसे ये क्वेश्चन बहुत इजी है इट्स एंटायरली इजी सो लेट अस सी हाउ इट कैन बी डन टोटल केसेस होंगे द नंबर ऑफ टोटल सॉल्यूशंस ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन इट इज 10 plus 3 minus 1 c3 minus 1 दैट इज 12 c2 व्हिच इज 12 into 11 by 2 दैट मींस 66 नाउ व्हेन z इज 0 x plus y is equal to 10 इसके हम टोटल सॉल्यूशंस लिख लेंगे अगेन व्हेन z is 2 x plus y 
is equal to what? It is equal to 8. Similarly, when z is equal to 10, then x plus y is equal to 0. इसके टोटल हम सॉल्यूशंस काउंट कर सकते हैं एक्स की वैल्यू यहां पे 0 से 10 तक कुछ भी हो सकती है तो इसके 11 केसेस होंगे इसी तरह यहां पे इसकी वैल्यू 0 से 8 तक कुछ भी हो सकती है इसके 9 केसेस होंगी इन सारे केसेस को अगर हम ऐड करते हैं तो सारे केसेस का सम जो आता है हमारे पास वो आता है 36 सो so, 36 आर द फेवरेबल केसेस और टोटल केसेस हमारे पास हैं 66 सो द रिक्वायर्ड प्रोबेबिलिटी इज डेफिनेटली 36 बाय 66 दैट इज 6 बाय 11 सो द करेक्ट आंसर इज आंसर ए फॉर अस